welcome. Here we will walk through a process of five patient observation checks. You can exit this up anytime, using the menu in the corner by the desk. Press start when ready. First, you need to learn how to move. Hold up on either thumbstick on your controllers, and point to where you want to go. Release the thumbstick to go there. Great, now let's pick up the pulse oximeter. Use either of the grip buttons indicated on your controllers. Use the grip button on your controller to pick up the pulse oximeter. Now, get a reading of the patient's blood oxygen saturation levels by placing the pulse oximeter on the patient's finger. This patient has normal blood oxygen levels. Place the pulse oximeter back on the table. Next, we need to check the patient's blood pressure. Pick up the armband. Attach the armband to the patient. Now, press the button on the blood pressure screen to get a full blood pressure reading. This patient's blood pressure is normal at 115 systolic pressure and a diastolic pressure of 74. Place the armband back on the stand. You need to check the patient's temperature. Now, pick up the non-contact thermometer. To take a reading, point the thermometer close to the patient's forehead and use the trigger button to take a reading. The patient's temperature is within the normal range. Now, put the thermometer back on the table. Next, you need to palpate and auscultate the patient's heartbeat. Move to the patient's right side. Let's start with auscultation. You have a stethoscope around your neck. Pick it up and place it on the patient for a few seconds. Great. The final step is to palpate for the rate, rhythm, and amplitude of the heart. Let go of your stethoscope. Now, place your first and second finger on the patient's neck, over their carotid artery until the timer goes green. That's it. You have completed all the steps. When ready, move over to the desk behind you and use the menu to close the app so that your progress is saved.